<laughs> What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Acres Lawn Care here. I hope you're doing well. So we are at a customer's job, regular customers, and we are about to tackle the overgrown garden behind their property. Now, we've had permission to do this, but it's we're only going to try and tackle about a metre of this this property away because what happens is it's so overgrown it comes and creeps into their into their hedge line and into their garden so we're just trying to try and cut back a meter of it along the fence line and then that way keep on top of it every few months just making sure it's maintained that way we've had permission for it so let's get cracking so let's show you actually what we're dealing with today over the fence now so it should be pretty stable as you can see alex is demonstrating right now Okay. Feeling a little wobbly. Just a little bit wobbly. Okay, so we're at the back of one of the first properties we do. But what we need to do is we need to get to the next property, which is actually down there. So we've got to create a little hole through here. Right, so we're on the property, so this is the property from here, that way, down. So if you pass me the camera quickly, you can see property through there. So we are on the fence line. So anything beyond, we need to clear back a metre because all this foliage here is going over the top. Permission from the landowner has said that we can just leave the foliage on the land. There's no problem with that at all. He will have a bonfire at some point. Um, but yeah, originally I think this land was for to try and develop property, but they're not going to do that now. So it's green belt. Right, let's get cracking, guys. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this content, consider liking and subscribing. That'd be brilliant. Let's crack on. So. probably actually do with the little chainsaw yeah yeah would you mind you got the key. yeah uh, could you grab my chainsaw trousers as well they're under the seat yeah, i'll grab, that. Uh, grab an uh, grab a 300 s battery for the chainsaw and just make sure the chain oil is topped up <laughs> <Anything else? laughs> uh full english breakfast <laughs> cheers mate get in there a little bit better now so this is what we got so fence line is here customers garden here all this is growing over so the idea is to try and clear just keep a nice upwards area cleared away um, just move it over I'll try and break it up as best as I can and just leave it stacked um, it's all gonna break down it's all natural stuff like I said, the landowner's given us permission anyway, so it's all good. Uh, he just said, yeah, do what you gotta do. You can see this tree coming up and over. It's just no care it has been taken to it for a while. So I'm gonna try and give this a bit of a cut back to give us a bit of room as well. Gaz is about to just make the entrance wider because it just seems pointless coming in and out, trying to get through. Good 
Trying to get, make a bit of space. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, so we've got some cheapo, cheap little loppers here from Wicko's, Wix. Uh, oh. I bought a pair of 60 quid steel ones and then after about a week of using them, they a bit of the rubber broke off them. Basically this bit on the steel ones here just perished quite quickly. Yeah, so we've got cool. some cheapo ones while them ones are still we're looking into uh, seeing if they want to give me a refund or an exchange. see now but you can see that's the hedge line we're behind so we climb up into a, through the tree there like just through just a little hole in the fence climb over and start clearing but you can see all that foliage along the back there and that's the land there <laughs> and that's how you uh, fell a tree to land straight up like that. That's how you get to a tree in your garden, practically. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Hang on, so now it's down, guys. We'll... caught on that is it sweet that can just take it up and just put it on the side there
Getting in here, clearing, able to walk down. That's how much we've cleared so far. That's quite a little bit, quite a lot. So this is where the ladder is, this is where the little hole we started climbing our way through. So, and we're down here now. It's so more than a meter we're cutting back just because it's just, I think it would just be better. Um, there's Gaz working away. That's it, and then uh, carry on going. So this mark here marks the back of the, so this fence here is the back of the garden. This marks about 75% way of the way done. So we've still got about another 25%, maybe a little bit more, but yeah, getting there. Whether we'll get it all done today, we don't know. As we're with regular customer jobs, we'll come back and just finish them off. Yeah, looking good. Alright guys, I look like someone weird. So, I look like a uh, 80s dance character as I went. Anyway, um, we are three quarters of the way through or over. Let me just show you what we've done so far. So just in case people are wondering where 
it all started. So we came in through this little gap in the fence and then we came down here. I've dropped my glove, hang on a sec. So yeah, we came in through this little gap in the neighbor's fence, come down here and then got to here basically. And this is where I went down. I was ducking down, trying to get through the little gap. And then we popped out about here. This is where that fence post I was chatting to you about is. And then cut away all in here, cut a load of stuff back. And then made our way, cut our way all the way down here. And then keep going all the way down the garden. <laughs> and then we're down to here now. So you can see the fence line. It's going to make our way down to there. Just got to battle our way through all this stuff. That's the garden there. And if I look back, that's what we've done.
pretty impressive. Oh, pretty impressive. Yeah, no, I don't think so. I mean, if you look up. But if I come back right down to the bottom, I'll show you guys the garden as well. I'll come right down here. So I'm right at the bottom. And then you can see how far we've cleared. You might not be able to see it from all the way up the top there. That's it. Well, so let's take a walk up there anyway. Guys, it's finished up the last. So the whole t idea was to cut a lot of this back. So we can walk up and down, cut it back easy, maintain it. Because all this, was remember, all this is going and pushing into the customer's garden, ruining the, fe the privet fence, privet hedge, sorry. So, oh, I'm knackered. I'm walking up here. So this is where, so here pretty much is where we went in. That little bit at the beginning. So cleared all that down there. Yeah, it's all good. We have piled it. We, we've not, you know, most of it is, um, I mean, the landowner of this land this is a huge bit of land here. Um, goes like an L shape. So you've got the fence there at the bottom with gazes. L's off and it goes down. So all this is like an L shaped bit of land. Um, it's a customer had the chance to buy it at one point and um, decided they didn't want it because it was all clear at one point. It was quite a beautiful bit of land, so they say. But yeah. All right. That's us done today, guys. Thank you for watching. Um, as always, if you enjoyed this content, consider liking and subscribing. That'd be brilliant. And uh, we'll see you in the next one. Ciao for now. Ooh. See you later, Gary. Adios, amigo. But thanks for watching, guys. Really appreciate it. And we'll, uh, yeah, we'll see you in the next one. Yeah, later, mate. Oh, mate. Oh, that, the YouTube crowd's a tough one, man. Half of them don't even subscribe. Oh, I know, mate. Oh, we're still videoing. Ooh.